I just took a crappy tail to the face. Hey, hey, it's your girl Andrea. Um, it is the same day as my most previous vlog. Um, just like three hours later and <laughs> I think we have our second set of twins for the day. So I'm headed to the farm. Mom texted, she's like, baby and pen too. I was like, oh cool, okay. You know, like I told you they were gonna start. Due date is here. And uh, there's two babies and one of them's sitting by himself. Ain't nobody caring. And he's a baldy and the other one's all black and mama that calved is a baldy. So the mom scrolled back on the cameras, which is why we have the cameras. Um, and she was taking care of the baldy calf. And now she's taking care of the black one. So looks like second set of twins for the <laughs> All right, let's do <laughs> Let's do it, I guess. <laughs> the other exciting update is that the twins, the first twins um, that we pulled this morning, were both kind of crying and kind of trying to get up. So that is good news. One, two. <laughs> yes, look at that. And it was on camera, she had two? Yes. Oh, they're both hers. I mean, they're good. That one's smaller. Yep. The baldy's smaller. So was the baldy first? No, black was first, baldy was second. Okay. Oh, she yeah. kind of knows they're both hers. I mean, we can try and see. She raised a really big calf last year. Did you have to knock it over? Yes. There you go. Yeah, she's licking the baldy now, so. I looked at you today, you didn't have that big of a bag. Hello. Hi, baby babies. You moved. Both of you did. What a time. Oh. <laughs> we were up. She's sitting nicer, and he's standing, and he pooped. Oh. <laughs> so that's good. No, he's like pushing his head forward, and I don't know if he's trying to like play or if he's just. I don't know. Oh. That's good. We got Good. colostrum in the baldy. The other one has been nursing mom, so um, he didn't want any. But the little baldy baby drank the entire dang thing, like 90% of it. So that's really good. That means he's getting his immunoglobulin proteins from the colostrum, which is really important. Helps them have 
So the question is how those calves get passive immunity. There's not much that really goes through the placenta at all. Um, unlike other species and stuff, calves have to have good quality colostrum because they like don't have an immune system at birth at all. Um, so, you know, all of like the pre-calving shots we give, it's all with the goal of passing immunity through the colostrum that the cow has. So, um, it's really important because if they don't get it, like those are the calves that will be chronic sick. They struggle, you know, like even if you get them past the first week, then they're more susceptible to scours. They're more susceptible to stuff like in the feedlot, all of that jazz. When there's twins, odds are they might be a little bit early and mom might not have enough quality colostrum. Cows are never guaranteed themselves to have like quality colostrum or the right circumstances that the calf gets enough um, in the window, because there's a very short window. It's like, depending on the source you look at, but really it's like six, eight hours is your goal. And honestly, within the first like two to four is like the gold standard. Um, so we have that on hand because of instances like this, where the black ones nursed a bunch, wasn't really hungry. He had like, he maybe took like four swallows of the replacer I gave him. Um, but the baldy was like, heck yeah, count me in. So now you've seen <clears throat> two sets of twins in the same day, but two different videos. Cause I was like, we're done for the day. We're not done for the day. So yeah, there's that. We usually have one or two sets a year or up to two. Um, last year we had two sets out of a heifer early, one alive, one dead. And then we had a cow I purchased at the sale barn. She aborted twins like two months early. So yeehaw, I guess, but I'm headed home now. So we'll see if I see you in the morning in the daylight or if I see you in the darkness again. <coughs> Good morning. So as far as I know, <laughs> nothing wild happened last night. So uh, we got to grind hay this morning. So, uh, Feeding is already partially done. Figure out the twin situation here and then we'll roll with whatever happens today. Mom said she likes the all black one better than the Baldy. So, and our other lady is out. So we'll see what happens today. And you're being happy. Oh boy, that's the girl. The boy's been standing already, but the girl's standing. <laughs> She's really unsteady on her front feet, but we also pulled on those pretty hard. Very hard, hard so. pull. There you go. There you go. And she's got a buckle on the front. Yeah, that's not helping her, but. That'll come. We're gonna go down. Nope. She just goes like chest down. She wants to move is half her thing, too. Yeah, she does. You're going to go fall over yourself there, honey. You need to drink. You need to drink. Keep into all black one. Sounds good to me. There you go. So she has a favorite. And the favorite is the black one. She doesn't hate that one, but she definitely prefers that one. Pull the baldy twin because she likes the all white one much more than she likes the baldy one. She knows they're both hers, but she's gonna struggle. She cares for two. She's not a big cow. Um, she's older. And if one of them is already not gonna be a favorite, eventually she'll be like, mm, screw ya type of deal. So, so tag the black one. He's good to go with her now. All good. And then now I'm gonna tag that Brockle face out of 2418. And then we're waiting to tag the twins to figure out what happens if they end up with a cow or something here. Um, if she takes one, I don't know. So that's the method of the madness right now. My zipper broke, so that's fun.
All done. Do you want your baby? Good, she's seen it better now, too. We're not going to actually like tag these twins because we don't know who they're going with and if we end up grafting or she takes one back. Um, we want them to have the right tag, so we're gonna give them all of their shots and spray needles and stuff that way they have the good start. So they'll just have everything besides their tags um, ready to rock. So we have the two first set of twins that are doing better now, which is good, and then the baldy here. So we also have my cousin who needs a bottle bucket calf for 4-H and was wondering if we were going to have a bottle calf and likely it looks like he's got a pick of three right now, so. Oh, no, this lady poked you, huh? Okay, and then you get half this one. And your brother's going to get the other half. Meeting your new friend. There you go. <laughs> Sixty-five. All right, gang. Made a pen for the gang to hang out. They can kind of go wherever, but it's supposed to get cold tomorrow. Calves like to lay here too, so maybe they'll lay here. But maybe her take one. I don't know. All I need is for him to find her and her to let him know. Yep. He's not kicking at him at all. So. Kicking me once, was it? Okay. This is good. Are you finding it? <laughs> Come here. Come here. Put your mouth down. Good girl. Oh. <laughs> He's kind of a dingus. Slow start. Slow start. I just took a crappy tail to the face. <laughs> Gross. Well, they're together. She smelled him a couple times, so we'll see what happens. And these two little guns are just chilling in here. Nice little place to hang out. She did just push one of the heifers here away from the baby, so maybe, maybe she's gonna claim him. Hi, honey. Hi, bubs. <laughs> Is this your baby? <laughs> Are you comfy right here? <laughs> you lay like a weirdo. Here. So that's good. It's a tough grinding day. Dust fest. Woo! Woo! Dusty! Um, <laughs> I'm gonna run home, do a couple things quick. Uh, <coughs> Dad's obviously working with a tough grinder. Um, and then the place we get our bulls from is having their sale today. We don't need any bulls. We're actually good to go unless testing is bad this spring. Um, but they have some really nice females on the sale that we're just gonna see and watch. You never know. So that's what's up now. Ooh, you can tell my lungs are still a little unhappy from being sick because I took like four steps jogging and I'm like dry heaving. I also need to try to fix my bibs. Annoyed.
Now waiting, now two and a half. I did come two and a half, now five, now five, now seven and a half. I did come up and now we need seven. I need to get a smarter TV, but uh, five, seven, we did not buy any bulls, which we didn't need to. We also didn't buy any females because they were higher than I thought they were going to be. Like 11 year old females for <laughs> almost three grand. So, um, like, yes, the cattle markets are high, but for commercial, it doesn't matter to us what genetics kind of look like, if that makes sense. So, I'm walking pens right now, getting the vibe. Checking on some ladies and my baby that I put in here. Good morning. Good morning. Maybe gets up. No babies. Nobody in action right at this moment. Lots of eggs. Lots of others filling up. So, but nothing at the moment. But. After uh, two sets of twins, now I'm just like, hmm, who's next? This helps her stand for a while. He's got a white tip on his tail, and he's drinking. And wrong colored ears. Oh yeah, I got some speckled he's, ears. He's got white in his ears. What's up, Titch? Hello. Thanks for all of your help right now. You're doing great. You drank half a bottle. She doesn't want to drink. She took a couple pulls, but that's about it. So we'll see if she wants to later tonight. Doing great for being a big calf. He's not that much of a dumb calf, which is good. Are you gonna have a baby at some point? No. <laughs> Little Miss Lady up is up, so that's good. Don't knock her over. Oh, now oh, she's down. Got too excited. Is that blue? Oh, I just came walking out. But she was standing. Well, I just walked the barn again. Um, nothing going on. I am on night duty tonight, though. So I will keep you posted if anything exciting starts happening. But we'll see. So if you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, make sure you hit that subscribe button and we'll see you next time.